Hello, 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 hello. Happy hump day. Happy Wednesday. Halfway through the week, my friends. You with your boy Cam from the beautiful Vancouver, Canada. How's everybody doing? Good to see you. We are live in your home, on your phone, on your tablet, or your TV, sharing the joy of games as we do every two nights. Like clockwork, baby. No headache tonight. Head cold still here, so I got the sniffles a little bit. No headache, which I am so thankful for. Oh, that fucking sucked. But we did get through at least three Colossi in our last stream on Shadow Colossus. So I like to think, you know what? Hey, we came to work and we powered through. That's what we do. <laughs> we are on episode five of our Pixel Remaster playthrough of Final Fantasy VI and loving every flipping minute of it. Unapologetic. I am just having a blast. The memories, memory lane is just beautiful. I'm just beside myself. I still can't get over the opera scene from two episodes ago. I will be doing a whole quickie on that, by the way. Don't think I, I haven't forgot. Changed my flipping life, I'll tell you that. Um, I feel like there's lots of stuff to talk about. <laughs> I'm just like, ooh, Final Fantasy VI. So I think we'll just get right into it. Last episode, we finally got to the Southern Continent and we went around all the towns. We saw how the Empire was treating its people, right? All occupied cities. Got into Vector, broke into the Magisite lab, saved a bunch of Espers who gave us their power, got out, had a, a challenge, had a problem. And then we're like, huh, okay. Hmm, if we're going to attack the capital vector, we got to do something. We need help. We can't just do it by Narsh and Figaro by ourselves. So, pardon me. We went to enlist the help of the Espers. We learned that Terra, a.k.a. Stephanie, is half Esper. So, we went to see if they would be willing to help. And I don't know if that was the right word, because they blasted out of their sealed fucking world and trashed our airship, and God knows what the hell else is going on. So we're going to pop back to Vector and figure it out. I think we actually showed you at the end. Vector is fucking shot. It's chalked. It's just done. So that is what is up. So, like I said, the Espers came out, but not to help. They trashed our airship, and a trash vector. It even looks like it's a little bit trashed. So let's go check it out. Actually, before we do, I just want to have a look at my abilities. So we're working on Kieran right now. Almost 100%. Uh, Lou is working on Phantom. How we doing there? Getting there. Yo, what's good, Pandy? Good to see you. Hello. <laughs> Did you have a chance to add more color to that picture you're working on that you put up in the Discord today? And how is our boy Christian here? Working on Katobal Pass. Almost got him with death. Not that big deal though. Damn straight. Fuck yeah. So Benny, you visited your grandparents for two weeks. How was that, dude? How'd that work out? How's that good? Let me know, man. It's it's coming back to me now, Benders. What in the world happened? Yeah, see? Now it's all the Narsh people here. They came in to do the attack. What's going on? Okay, hold on. There's, uh, I can... Listen, youngsters, please don't give up. There we go. Now we're all full. There we go. On the big screen, let's go. The big screen. You gotta get up at 8 in the morning? You got work tomorrow, Zero? What's the deal, bro? What's going on? Yeah, everyone here is shell shocked. Like Vector is just trash right now. It was like this when we got here. What happened here? Wait, did the Espers do this? No, they couldn't have. Haircut and work? Gotcha. What in the world happened? When you unleash a power that you have little knowledge and control over. The Emperor is expecting you. This way, please. 
Yo, we're about to have a dinner and there's special choices that allow me to get a second Genji glove. I don't know if I'm going to remember them or not. It's been over 20 years, guys. Shit, let's find out. Camino, Hello, hello. Good to see ya. As a great chair once said. Hello there. <laughs> Probably butchered that impression. Good to see you, Camino. And Davo over on D-Live. What's good, Davo? Good to see you. Welcome to the streams. You like this stuff with your girlfriend? Like with your grandparents was go to Lincoln, Nebraska? <laughs> well, quite frankly, Benders, it was probably just the time that you got to spend with them. The location doesn't matter. It was the time that you got to spend with them, I hope. Alright. Dude, they even have magic tech armor in the building. The espers that came out of the gate tore us to shreds. I've lost the will to fight. The Emperor imprisoned Kefka after he learned about everything he'd done. Sounds like Kefka may end up spending the rest of his life behind bars. General Kenobi, but you just fine having fun. Oh, Kamino, I haven't played this over 20 years, but I am having the time of my life replaying this. The, me the memories, and I'm going to post on the YouTube channel, they voice acted the opera scene. This was two episodes ago. I almost fell out of my chair. So, don't worry. In the, in the next week or so, I'm going to have a quickie up of that. It's crazy good. And they made it 2.5D. The war's over. Emperor is waiting for you. Although, you did go to Kansas City back and your dad all alone. That sounds like quite the trip. Holy shit. All right. Doing well, Dave. Glad, uh, Davo, good to hear it. I am absolutely fantastic. We're halfway through the week. And uh, have a bunch of awesome people hanging out with us here. So, plus we're playing Final Fantasy VI, so it's a win in, in my book. <laughs> I've lost my will to fight. The Emperor's had a change of heart. Sid. The Espers came to save their friends. When they learned that none of them were alive, they ravaged the entire city. Their shrieks of rage will haunt me forever. We're hanging up our weapons for good. The war's over. The power of those espers. I had no idea. You still have to finish at Final Fantasy 3 3D? I think I have that for my DS, but I never really played it. So when I played on the Pixel Remaster, it was the first time I, I really got into it. We, I had fun with it. Final Fantasy 3 did the job system better than Final Fantasy 5. I said what I said. They'll destroy the entire world if we don't do something. We're utterly helpless against them. We must find a way to calm their rage. We should never lust after power we lack the means to control. I just said that. Friends, let us speak more over dinner tonight. We, 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 we just friends now like that? Oh, your mom's still asleep, Andy? <laughs> oh, she's probably earned, earned the rest. It's all good. <laughs> Nothing new for you, Panny, just watching all the John Wick movies? Nice. That's a good choice. What happened when you were with your girlfriend was crazy? Well, I'm... As long as it's positive, man, I'm happy for you. You think all the first six deserve a cute 3D remaster? They have Final Fantasy IV did that. There's still some soldiers we'd prefer to keep fighting. Please, talk to as many as you can before dinner. Make them understand. You have four minutes until dinner. Please talk to as many soldiers as you can. Right, there's a specific order I need to do this in. I forget what it is. Three and four, what if one, two, five, and six? Dude, I, I've heard them say the reason why they haven't done any type of remaster of Final Fantasy VI is because it would take them years to do. But yeah, I've heard rumblings of a remaster of Final Fantasy IX is in the works. All right, let's uh, talk to as many as we can. Yeah. Yeah. Is there any out here? I forget. There is. Oh shit, they, that's right. Uh, shit. Uh, shit. Tool chainsaw. Nice. Fibonacci was on four discs. Yeah, so it's Final Fantasy VIII, too. 
Wow, you're as strong as they say. Yeah, exactly. At this point, guys, I don't want to... Still alive, huh? Facts. Anything over here? Nope. So I remember the more soldiers we talk to, the more, uh, like, chance of gifts we get. Alarm earring. Okay, cool. X potion. This game was your first to Fall Fantasy? Bro, what an amazing fucking game. To come, like, to be the first one. Fall Fantasy 4 was my first. Fall Fantasy 4 was my first. This guy is fucking dead. He has no clue. Bro, stop it. What? How are we missing? Thank you. Okay. Huh, not bad. Yeah, just kick your ass, bro. What? Good. Imaginary research facility been shut down. Guys in the can. Shit on the poo on peace. Ha ha ha. Let's go. Hello, Angelina. Good to see you. Welcome. We just got started here on uh, episode five. Hope you're having a great Wednesday. Guess some people can't be pushed around. Yeah. Even if you thought they could, why would you? Because you're an asshole. That's why. <laughs> Final Fantasy was so much better to you. I mean, there's a lot of really good things about... I mean, Final Fantasy VI improved on things in so many ways. It's ridiculous. Long live the Empire. Okay, well, whatever, bro. Kefka scum serves him right. Okay. Get out of my face. Okay, fine, sir. Whatever you say, buddy. Yeah. Kefka's gonna throw in jail. Anyone in here? Oh, shit. Shit, 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 shit. We're out of time here. Why don't you join up with the likes of you? Because we're better than you, buddy. You not like us. You not like us. A little Kendrick in there for y'all. Yeah, Final Fantasy VI was absolutely nuts. Uh, for its time. Like, I, I said in previous episodes, they were trying to do cutscenes before cutscenes were a thing with full motion videos in, uh, like, the PlayStation versions. Lost your whole family in war. Jeez. Ba, 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 ba. This is ridiculous. Yeah, I know, right? That's for Shooter Dream, they were that powerful. <laughs> I don't know, they only talked to you about the War of the Magi for like a thousand years. Oh, hey, Kefka, but using poison, how low can you go? Holy water. Okay, I will catch up on chat here, guys, once we have, we finish the time thing. Oh, hello, sir. Yeah, how dare they put me in a place like this? Ah. I just can't believe it. What a bore. Yeah, the dude's psycho. <laughs> yeah, Kefka's guy psycho. So, for those who haven't seen the game before, um, I think I talked to everybody. Kefka was the very first Magitek knight Sid experimented on, but the process hadn't been perfected yet. And so he gained all this amazing magical power, but it also fucked with his head. Right? I guess, yeah, we can begin. Let me catch up on chat here real quick. Alright. Let's see here. So, I was busy getting uh, ready for your girlfriend's uh, grad stuff there, Benders. All right, gotcha. We see a lot of grads right now, too. Uh, in our area, a lot of, lot of uh, high school kids done up in their tuxes and dresses and stuff. They're looking sharp, too. Now, what else? Ba -ba. So, Friday night, you got to sleep in the same bed? Fantastic. You hate the time limit, Andy? It's all right. It, it wasn't that bad. Ba, 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 ba. Let's see. It's also because of this game that you don't care for seven. To me, seven's a, a juggernaut in its own right, in my opinion. I love I love both. I do like this more just a little bit than seven. Just like Final Fantasy IV, I like it a little bit better than this, even though 
I think it's because 4 was my first. Because without 4, I wouldn't have played any of the other ones. Personally. Uh, let's see. After graduation stuff, we're trying to go on a walk. End up being some pretty wild atmospheric instability of storms. Holy shit. Hope you guys didn't get rained out. So you say 6, 4, and 3 over 7 for you. But you really give 7R a chance to have a style on Rebirth. I enjoyed Rebirth. I, I did. I can't wait to try... Uh, or no, no. Remake. Because I, I liked Remake. We played that. But I, I, I need a PS5, so we'll get there. Time where you have puddles flap and falls in cards. That's crazy, dude. <laughs> Reminds me of some Fall Fantasy X shit in Xanarkin. As power tends to do, right? Yeah, Patty, exactly. A lot, lot of pain. Uh, well, at least it's not raining right now, Elizabeth. So it's easier for you. Okay, let's begin the banquet here, and I hope I can get this Genji glove. I can remember what answers I have to give. That evening, a banquet was held with the Emperor. This way, please. I'll sit with the returners, if that's all right. At last, we can all be together, sharing a meal at the same table. Let us make a toast. To what shall we raise our glasses? To the Empire, to the returners. I remember this one. I always say to our homelands, because it's neutral. Well then, to our homelands. Cheers. As you may know, I've imprisoned Kefka for his crime of using poison against Doma. What do you think should be done with him? Leave him in jail, pardon him, execute him. I think I always remember, I remember always leave him in jail. I see. Well, let's have him stew in his cell for a while, and then we can decide what to do. I'm truly sorry about what occurred in Doma. No one ever dreamed Kefka would use poison. What's done is done. That was inexcusable. Apologize again. I think I always chose apologize again. I think I chose. I'm terribly sorry about what was done. <laughs> I promised to punish Kefka severely and to work to eradicate poisons from the world. By the way, with regard to General Elizabeth, was she an Imperial spy? Elizabeth's last. We trust her whether she spied or not. I think I, I don't remember the answer I usually go with on this one. Kefka was lying. General Elizabeth realized the lunacy of this war long before I did and went over to your side. Was there anything else you wanted to ask? Why did you start the war? Why do you want peace now? Why do I talk to your men? Because I now believe that working together is our only hope. With your permission, I'd like to move on to discussing the espers. I saw everything things asked. Okay, let's start with the Esper. Before we do, let me catch up on chat. <laughs> it's a good thing you have that recliner uh, upgrade there, Elizabeth. So you can use that. This one looks like a human Goomba. The yellow guy? Are you talking about Sid? I, I said he looks like a banana condom last episode, the way he's done up like that. <laughs> anyway, that week was kind of lost sitting around, but it gets interesting when you get to the Wednesday, May 22nd. Okay. Do you have a game store in any of the shopping centers there? I know there's like Rideau Center always quietly does something pretty useful for Black Friday, so maybe you can score PS3. Maybe. I might. Um, we'll see. Like I said, there's a lot of other stuff. Uh, like our kids gotta come first. Uh, family finances first, unfortunately. Um, thankfully, um, so, I mean, I don't like to mention this very often, but um, for those who are subscribed on Kick. And those who have donated to the PayPal, that specifically goes towards upgrading the channel. So any uh, kick subscribers um, and any of the PayPal donations, majority of that goes towards whatever we're saving up towards for the stream, uh, for, for the channel, which right now is a PS5 Pro when that comes out. Last thing we bought was this guy here. So now my PS4 doesn't sound like as much of a jet to you guys. And then a small percentage of that goes to a local charity as well. So I actually have a video being made about that pretty soon. So we'll see, Camino. It was the night before time to get ready for your family and you went to play some Mario in our grandma's basement. <laughs> All right, let's talk about the Espers. The Empire has been ravaged by the Espers that emerged from the Seal's Gate. They're just too powerful. If we don't do something, they'll tear the entire world apart. Huh, they have gone a bit too far. You're the one who brought them here in the first place. When the Espers came through on their rampage, all of my ambitions faded in an instant. Now I find myself asking why I ever wanted that much power in the first place. Of course, there is no excuse for the atrocities I committed. 
By the way, what was that first question you asked me a minute ago? Why do you want peace now? I remember this. Ah, th that's right. Anyway, I, I truly desire peace. I want you to understand that. You must be getting tired. Why don't we take a short break? What are you talking about, Sid? <laughs> yes, we will take a short break. Okay. Charity, that's wholesome. Well, the whole goal of why I'm doing this, Camino, isn't just for me, right? The first thing I do this for is I play games at nighttime anyway after the kids are in bed, so I might as well share it with, with all you guys and, and have fun doing it. However, if we are able to grow, and we have been always growing little by little, if we're able to grow to a point where uh, I'm able to say, you know what, we're good. So I want to be able to give. Right now, in, in our state of life, for our family, we're just focusing on working as hard as we can, making as much money as we can for us, for our household, for our kids, for our debts. I don't want to live that way. Eventually, I want to be able to say, you know what, we're good. Who can we help? Because God knows a lot of people and organizations need help out there. And they're not getting it from local governments. They're not getting it from provincial or, or state governments. They're not getting it from the federal governments. They're not getting it from jobs they're supposed to get. They're not getting it from the fucking degrees they were told they were supposed to go into debt to get. Right? Go to school, get a good education, get a good job. And then what? People with freaking degrees out their ass can't get jobs. They're, they... they no, I don't want to do this. Hold up. Let me get out of here. We'd like to test your strength. Would you be willing to fight for just a couple minutes? Absolutely. Right? So I, my vision is in some way so, to be able to be a giving. I want to be able to give, not just take. You know what I mean? So even though we are a very small community here, any donations that we happen to get Yes, I want to upgrade the quality of the channel, you know, be able to get the games you want us to play, but I'd love to be able to give to the you know, organization that needed to. So, anyway, let's kick these guys' ass. Ba -ba, uh, let's flash. Ba -ba -ba. Let's go. Bro, we one shot at those guys? <laughs> Let's go. Okay. Your grandma can't get down the stairs. Now's our chance. What? Play the first level of my eyes, but I'll break the chair soon. You think degrees are the biggest scam? I don't think they're a scam. I think the expectations set. For them have been a scam because back in the day think about the education system right back in the 60s, 40s 50s 60s people who went to school were able to um differentiate themselves from the from, okay my control is fucking up here i hate that uh differentiate differentiate themselves from the masses that's why there was value around it now everyone and their dog can get a freaking degree so who are you differentiate yourself from right a lot of people in my generation and the late boomers as well were told if you get this good good job education you'll make it and that worked for decades it's not working anymore okay i thought i was gonna get the genji glove but all right let's sit back down yes <laughs> Let's go over to Dr. Sign. A lawyer, yes. See, degrees and certificates and certifications are absolutely important if you're doing a job that requires them. I want my pilot to be fucking certified out the ass. Right? I want my doctor and my surgeon to be certified up the ass with doctorates and all the shit. <laughs> Is there anything you wish to hear me say? That you genuinely want peace, that you're really over that you're sorry. All right. I truly and sincerely wish for peace. And now I have a favor to ask. <laughs> Speaking of new games, you're hyped for Fable next year? Yeah, that's pretty sweet. I'm super... I, I lost my mind over Doom. I, in fact, I hold, I did a whole reaction video on, on the, the Doom trailer. If you haven't seen that, head over to the, uh, the Cam Watches channel. 
It's in the uh, beacons.ai slash community. It's a 30 minute reaction video. <laughs> so hopefully your guy doesn't uh, mention the chair suddenly being broken. <laughs> you know what, Benders? I'm happy for you, bro. I, I'm sincerely happy for you. I'm glad you, you had the chance to spend some quality time with the girlfriend. After they attacked us, the Espers flew off northward towards Crescent Island. We have no way of knowing when they'll decide to go on another rampage. We need to find them and convince them to set aside their aggression before that happens. But considering all the Empire has done to them, I, I doubt they'll be willing to listen. That's why I need Stephanie's help. Oh, oh my fucking controller! The analog stick is fucking doing shit. So basically what they're saying is, hey, the Espers are over on this island right now. We don't know when they're going to cause shit again. They're not going to listen to us. Because Stephanie, Tara, is part Esper, maybe they'll listen to her. Can you please go? Right? So that's what the deal is. Doomenstein? <laughs> now I'm trying to remember, will I please be on board, yes or no? If I choose no... God. Uh, my top general and some of his troops accompany as well. General Leo. General Leo got a freaking tan, man. I'm General Leo. Pleased to make your acquaintance. Didn't I see that guy in Doma? Oh, right. He was one of the principals. So that's General Leo, huh? I'll be waiting for you in Albrook. Please, find the Espers and convince them to cease their attacks. You're our only hope. If Stephanie goes, I'll go. Christian, thank you. The rest of you stay here. I smell a rat. As do I. It's hard to trust the Emperor just like that. We shall remain here and watch for anything out of the ordinary. Thanks. You'll be our eyes and ears. Keep your guard up. Right. You be careful, too. I think I missed out on the Genji Glove. Damn it. I did something wrong. Ah! Genji Glove is like one of the most strongest uh, relics in the game. What is this? Ah, uh, okay. Just a uh, brokered piece. Constant listening study is super funny coming from me. Yeah. <laughs> Are these found to uh, Terra uh, Music Journal? Ska Punk? That would probably be interesting, Camino. Next morning, a few things showered. Yeah, very efficient, but also very fun. Without things you guys since you're spending the night at the farm and you're eating next night. Nice. Hold on. Uh, first and foremost, let's. Uh... Oh, we can just equip whatever we want anyway. Cool. And we already have good weapons here, so I think we're good. The war is over. War is over. Dang it. I'm so mad I lost... I, I think it was a Genji Glove. Oh, hold on. I bear a message from the Emperor. Due to your decorum at tonight's banquet and your grace in speaking to our soldiers beforehand, the Emperor has decided upon the following. All Imperial troops will be withdrawn from South Figaro immediately. In addition, Imperial forces will be withdrawn from the Kingdom of Doma. We'll also unlock the armory at the Imperial Observation Post to East. Nice. You're welcome to any of the weapons and armor within. And this is a personal gift from the Emperor. Oh! In the original game, in the Super Nintendo is called a Tintinabar. So they call it a Tintinabulum. I don't think that's what I wanted. I wanted the Genji Glove. Fuck. Now, if you'll excuse me. We're, 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 we're sleep in a grain silo? That is kind of uh, interesting. That's awkward. <laughs> Albrook support town of the South of the Empire. The plan is to leave for Crescent Island from Albrook on a transport ship carrying Magitek armor. We'll keep a close watch on the Empire. You deal with the Espers. Yeah, so it's in Tinnabar. Small bell rings as the werewalks. Restore some HP at each step. Yeah, see, that's kind of cool. 
But it's not a Genji glove. So. My disappointment was strong? Yeah, a little bit. Genji glove is fucking fire. There's a, a there's, I think it's called a gem box. I, I think it's the gem box. You can get the gem box relic because it lets you attack um, eight to, uh, four times, right? Now, if you have the Genji glove on, that means you get to attack eight times per turn. It's crazy. All right. Let's go pick up all the good shit first before we uh, hit over on the, the ship there. There's my guy. I see ya. Is it really safe to trust the Empire? I have an awfully bad feeling about this. Okay. I'm not saying this feels like you're playing Star Wars, but... Well, we have an Imperial army here, right? Vector, like the Empire. They're called the Empire, for fuck's sake. <laughs> right? So, I get it. Well, I already have the Genji glove. You can get at least two Genji gloves in the game uh, through pickups. And then the gem box is a special item that you have to fight to win. Now, let's double check our espers here real quick, what we're working on. Uh, unicorn. Uh, I guess. Yeah, we'll keep it as is. Let's do a quick save. The audacity was to call it a bunkhouse. It wasn't a bunkhouse, it was a bear empty gutty green silo. Oh, that sucks, Benders. But hey, you had pleasurable company, so I'm sure you guys made the most of it, am I right? There's on. There we go. Yeah, you had some time alone to make sure you make yourselves at home. The bunkhouse, there you go. Yeah, there you go, man. Absolutely. That's a fun story. <laughs> All right, magic. Let's go fire. And let's do a little bit of a little fire, a little ice. At least we found benders again. Yeah. No, that's going to be that's a fun little story. And once again, that's just a cool memory to have with your with your your lady friend, right? All right. Um, to get to Luton. I mean, treasure hunting, because we all know Christian isn't a, a thief. He's a treasure hunter. Wow, we got a lot of goodies here. Angel Wings, X Potion, 8,000 Dada, High Ether, Angel Ring, Alarm Earring, Elixir, very nice. Hermes Sandals, $20,000. Reflect Ring. 13,000 off, so we got money for days. And a flame tongue sword, there we go. Ah. Man, they sort a lot of shit down. What the fuck? I didn't know about that. I did not know about that at all. Holy shiza, that was great. No Genji glove, though. I got your land hooked up finally, nice, Camino. Burnout 3 multiplayer works? Uh, Discord me. I, I don't. I can't promise my availability, but uh, DM me on Discord and we'll see if we can make something work there to test out, alright? Just rob the Empire? No, Pandy, we earned that. They unlocked it on purpose because of our proper decorum at the banquet. So we didn't steal none of that shit. <laughs> we earned it. Luna sends love. Send it right back to her. Give her, give her some pats for us. Ba, 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 ba. Oh, we don't have a uh, bio yet. That sucks. I know who does though. <laughs> Bop. Shit, I didn't have my rumble chat up. Damn it. We go. Ba, 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 ba. A mithril rod. The rod is mithril. Uh, can we want a flame tongue? We got a stone blade and a. That's about the same. Oh, the same. No, I want flame. I want ice brand. All right. Another save. Ba, 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 ba. More like you made them afraid to piss you off. They just want. <laughs> yeah. But if they, that was true, they didn't pay me off with what I wanted, the Genji Glove. So I should go kill all of them now? I guess we should, shouldn't we, Pandy? 
How, actually, how's our items right now, real quick? Um, let's just uh, top up. Do tell us Day of the Lions. It said on the final sign Day of Humanity, Satch the Lions will come to life, fight for dignifying death. Basically, comfort the children. It's like, oh, the kitties. Oh. Or they can be friendly like Aslan. Lion, Witch, in the Wardrobe. Uh, eye drops. Let's bring this up to 10 total. Actually, I think we're going to want 15, if I remember correctly. Remedy, let's bring this up to 5. Shit, now I gotta make it 10. Damn it. Uh, let's bring up 10. I don't care about that. Uh, I don't know what that sound was. Holy shit. <laughs> I think we're good here. Thank you. You're welcome. Go ahead. Remember that I like soccer. That we take no prisoners. <laughs> That's true. The port is open. Friendly lions. Why didn't they put lions out here? I guess so, yeah. General Leo is waiting for you. Ah, there you are. Another Imperial General and a man I hired back in town will be accompanying us as well. Hey! And Shadow's with us. Let me introduce them. General Elizabeth and Infinity. Or Infinite. Once again, when I can, I try to name the characters after you people in chat, so... Uh, is something the matter? Uh, no, it's nothing. Well, we depart tomorrow. In the meantime, I've arranged lodging for you at the inn. Please, try to get some rest. Elizabeth. She still feels a little bit bad about what Kefka said, even though we learned the truth from the Emperor, like, she legit wasn't spying. I'm working for the Empire. But don't worry, they didn't hire me to kill you. Woof. Sorry, I'm discussing our plans with General Leo right now. Please, try to get some rest. Alright, so we gotta go sleep. I should call all of them. Come for the children. <laughs> Kamekin Skywalker. <laughs> should kill all. <laughs> Kamekin. <laughs> oh gosh. General Leo already made arrangements for your stay here tonight. By all means. The Empire Strikes Back. Actually, the name of our last episode, Christian, was... What was it? Like, we were striking at the Empire or some shit like that. So I already made a play on, on the Empire in, in Star Wars. <laughs> ah, here we are. Christian, you got yourself stuck between two ladies here, my friend. Elizabeth. Darth Gamer? Oh my god, I love that. Please, why won't you talk to me? Look, I know I doubted you. But only for a moment, but we can still be friends, right? Elizabeth. So she's still choked that she, we kind of doubted her for a second there when Kefka called her out. You deal with that a lot? Hey! <laughs> Pound it. <laughs> My care is sleepwalking, right? Yo, that Darth Gamer thing? Oh, yo, I should try to figure out how to utilize that somehow. I like that. I love that. The lions do sacrifice themselves so the children may die due to the cataclysm of hunger or murder of the Anarchy. So it's like, shitty death or good death? You're gonna die either way, so pick one. <laughs> yeah. I've watched Star Wars act like, no, I'm not Angelina. I haven't had a chance to really be up to date on, on too much Star Wars stuff, to be fair. It's just been too crazy busy with life and kids and stuff. It's it's amazing that I'm able to actually consistently stream every two nights for, for with everybody. I'm super proud of it, by the way. I ain't gonna lie. We've we've consistently held the schedule for over a year plus. I think there's been a couple nights here or there where we've had to switch things around a little bit, like Christmas and whatever, but pretty proud of it. Plus, we get the replays out pretty consistently, too. So, can I, if you haven't already, protect your home with a lion statue because maybe one day it'll fight for you. I will keep that in mind, actually. Have a little lion there. That'd be cool. Appreciate that, Benders. Elizabeth, you may have a movie day on Friday with your mom. Nice. Do you know what uh, movie is on the list, Elizabeth? All right. Let's get on board. All right. Let's go. Dude, Leo looks crazy tan, man.
Don't know how it would feel if Lion Satch came to life. Depends if it bites you or not. <laughs> you don't know how it feels. The engines are all running smoothly, sir. Yeah. We should arrive tomorrow morning. Why don't you rest until then? Now, we're getting super rested up here. Oh, loon has got the zoomies? <laughs> nice. <laughs> now we're out on a ship. Keep out of the engine room. It's dangerous. Yes, Artemis. Artemis. No? You do that thing cats do? She comes up to me, like puts her paws on me, meows at me. I go to give her attention and she's like, fuck off now. Hey. What? Oh, yeah. There's the cat. There she is. There she is. There she is. Can you see meow? Meow, meow, meow. Meow, meow, meow. My goal. My goal is to get to a point where she, like, stays here with me and I can play with her resting on my chest while we stream. That'd be pretty cool. <clears throat> but, hey, I, we have all been blessed by the presence of the cat. I mean, she must have heard we were talking about lions or something there, right, Benders? <laughs> Having trouble sleeping? I hear your emotions have returned. <laughs> That's one way to put it. It's strange, isn't it? The Empire used me, controlled my very thoughts, and now here I am cooperating with the same people. Well, people are people. Not everyone in the Empire is like Kefka. So, what about you then? I knew that you were being made to suffer through horrible experiments because one of your parents was an Esper. Yet I did nothing. I'm no better than Kefka. If a human and Esper can love one another, do you think a human and I could love each other? Of course. But I don't even know what it feels like to love someone. Well, you're still young. Someday you'll know. I'm sure of it. Now that... Well... But, I want to know now. <laughs> I want to know what love is. <laughs> the laments of young people. <laughs> you start by loving that mohawk. Pandy! Oh my goodness. <laughs> Who's there? Ah. Thought I'd sleep out under the stars. Did you hear what we were talking about? I didn't mean to listen in. So... I can't help you. Those answers you'll have to find for yourself. Stephanie. There are people in this world who've chosen to kill their own emotions. Remember that. Ugh. 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 Well, seasick. Ugh, the world's greatest treasure hunter. Reduced to this. 
<laughs> now, Pandy, are you talking about Shad uh, Infinite's response or General Leo's response? I'm sorry to hear your first love die young, Elizabeth. That's tough. Very unfortunate. You fair you don't feel bad for Christian? <laughs> Bro really did doubt. And hurt his friend. He could be he could take being seasick. Yeah. Fair, fair. But tragedies occur when people try to create miracles. Well, there's a difference between miracles happening organically versus trying to create a miracle. A I don't think you can create a miracle. You can maybe manufacture something that's close, that's positive and good. But miracles just happen. I think that's why they're miracles. It's like so, not something you could even, even if you were trying for it, the chances were almost non existent, but it still happens. That's a miracle. So, the reply to the girl's question, Infinite. But if you know Infinite's character, that's very on point for his character, right? Stephanie's like, hey, well, maybe this guy can give me some answers because she's looking for answers. Like, I'm half human, half Esper. Can I find love? Can I love someone? I've never felt that before. Like, uh, you know, she's searching. And he was true to himself. He's like, listen, hey, I can't help you. This is a you thing. Right? Because here's the thing. A lot of people, just because people have their own life experiences doesn't make it good advice for you. Right? And he's not very emotional. He's very closed off. Shadow is, or infinite is. Right? He's an assassin, man. He kills people. He doesn't give a fuck. So he was able to be straight with her and say, hey, listen, you need to keep working on you. And I will say, working on me, I wouldn't have met or, or met Nikki at all. Right? Good things come into place the more you focus on improving yourself, in my experience. And so I look at his infinite saying to Stephanie, she, he's like, listen, you got to look within you for this. Just because you want it now, right? Don't stop working on it. Is, is my thoughts on that. It's actually crazy now that I'm freaking old as shit. And I'm looking back on this and, and my view on this has changed so much. Or I'm understanding more than I did when I first played this so long ago. We're almost at Crescent Island. When we make landfall, we'll split into two groups. I'll go with Elizabeth, Stephanie, you go with Christian and Infinite. Finding clues as to where the espers may be hiding, report back at once. Alright, let's go. <laughs> this is my TED talk. <laughs> Infinite. Oof. Uh, Christian. I, um. Come on. Yo, now he's being cold. They're both exchanging cold shoulders, man. Yeah. Leo's just sitting there like, I don't know what the fuck's going on, man. <laughs> Your view has always been the same since you were very young. That might have to do with uh, the way you were raised or influences that you've had in your life uh, up to that point. I didn't have those influences. Like, I, I grew up going through foster homes and all that shit. Uh, social workers basically said that I was going to end up in the downtown east side selling drugs, pimping or prostitution and all that shit. I just have to say, no, that's not the case. Now, uh, a s infinite needs a little something here. Actually, hold up, hold up, hold up. We need to get him some. We're just gonna do a quick little grind here. I just wanna get him to get these. We're, let's just do a quick little grind here, okay? He's such a dude. <laughs> I, I don't know if I agree with that though, Pandy, just because I, I believe in telling it like it is. 
And he he stuck to his, his, his who he is. He didn't try to change, just to try to make her feel better. And I think a person is super valuable when you know what to expect from them. Like they are rock solid, they're consistent. You know what to expect, what you're gonna get from them. Someone who is rock solid and consistent in their life, I find, is so valuable, personally. It's hard to be that, too. Like, I struggle with it, personally. Being consistent from day to day. <laughs> nice, Christian learned death. That's pretty sweet. Um, let's do abilities. Uh, what can he learn now? Carbuncle? No, hold up. Oh, he could learn a lot of that shit, though. Uh, he's already got that shit. Uh, I don't know what that noise was. Don't, don't, don't judge me. Mmm, Rasplosmos I can get from Golem, right? No, I can get from... Yo. Mm. I think we should get it from Zone Seek. Let's go. Bomb. Done. Create a mad guitar solo? How I didn't know you play guitar, Bender. <laughs> You're technically fighting a turtle horse and calamari. <laughs> True. <laughs> You feeling for the Elizabeth character, Elizabeth? Not just because of the name, right? So it wasn't quite yours without getting too tragic. Your mom was the one who raised you. And I was in a really dark space for a long time. Made your therapist say, what the fuck? Explain your child. I, I feel like we can relate on, on a lot of levels there, Camino. Just with our, our, you know, tough childhoods. I'm sure all of us here had tough childhoods in some way, shape, or form. Stop your time. I didn't tell Christian when he was giving her the culture. Oh, yo, 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 yeah. See, like, but isn't like in real life? There's people like people act that way. It's like you know, because he tried to reach out, he tried to apologize, and she was like, uh, "I'm just gonna run away." And so he's like, "Well, fuck, I tried." Then now, she tries to switch up. He's like, "Fuck, whatever, man. I gotta go. Like, I got shit to do, you know." And you're trying. <laughs> so yeah. If it's kind of cool, then that well, it, it, the the guy's name is technically a shadow, but Infinite uh, is actually one of the uh, viewers who was here uh, during when we named him in the stream. So yeah. Oh, you did uh, digital? That's still cool, Benders. That's nice. Throw it up in the Discord. Nineteen ninety nine. You don't want to live it. Being bullet teased for being deaf, left your only. Yeah. Kids fucking suck. I I went through the bullying shit too. I went through the bullying shit too. Yo, he just knocked me the fuck out of here. <laughs> We're just gonna grind until uh, Shadow or Infinite learns his uh, three spells and then away we go. Actually, how is uh, Stephanie doing here? Who does she have? Uh, Unicorn? Okay, she's getting there. He was already down there because someone else's bullshit. Well, to be fair, yeah, Kefka, you know, Kefka did a great job on the way he fucked. Yeah. Ooh, we can use one. Yo, hold up. Whoa, 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 whoa. Turtle horses hit hard. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of weird looking. It's called a Briarius. Interesting. So yeah, he's just over greeting that process. Yeah, that's you're, you're not wrong, Patty. I can see that. Versus when teacher is bullying? Yeah, that sucks. That's that's super tough. For me, the worst bullying I experienced was in high school. High school was rough when it came to that shit. Uh, we are a unicorn. Almost there. How is our boy doing? Okay, we're getting there. A couple more battles, friends, and then we'll be able to move on with the story. I did have a very good uh, comeback on one of my bullies, though. I ain't gonna lie. You need a pet turtle horse? I know, that'd be crazy unique, right? <clears throat> Middle school for you, Panty? Got it. Not done. So remix a you know, M1 at Doom's Gate. Trying to figure out how to make this more slow merge. Okay. 
Well, whenever you get it done, if you want uh, any feedback or thoughts, just throw it my way, Benders. I'll be happy to give you some, uh, my experience with it. So, one of my bullies, who partook in uh, name-calling, we were in the same gym class together. Now, the thing about me is I'm a weird mix of person. Ooh, nice. <clears throat> I tend to like uh, reading fantasy and science fiction books, play video games, right? I understand, you know, nerd culture, right? Things like that. Plus, I was not part of the popular crowd. The side difference, though, is I've played sports my whole life, and I was also quite competitive in the sports I played. Big sports for me in high school, well, growing up was lacrosse, physical sport. Basketball, not as physical, but it was my main go-to sport. That That's what saved me. Basketball saved my life grow, going through things as a kid, right? So I was on the high school basketball team, so I was athletic. And so in gym class, we were doing wrestling, right? And this guy gets partnered up with me. The teacher has no fucking clue, right? Christian just got his shit done here, so hold on. We almost got him maxed out. Let's fucking go. Go oh, Kate Seth. She's almost done. How's our boy? Almost there. So, this guy and I get uh, paired up, right? And what the drills we're going through is, is like the guy, you know, you put your guy into a headlock, a front headlock, and they have to get out of it, right? So, um, I'm watching what other people are doing, right? Now, the other thing that I happened to, like, I was way more into it at the time. Not as much now. I don't really follow as much. I'll catch highlights here and there. But, at the time, I was heavy into WWF. Right? Heavy into World, World Wrestling Federation, or WWE as it's called now. So I'm watching what other partners are doing, how they're getting out of the hold and what they're doing there. And then something just clicked. I saw what was going on. I'm like, oh yeah, I'm going to fucking get this guy. He has no clue what's going to happen. Now, I'll tell you in a sec here, and I'll catch up on chat. Because I know you guys have your stories too, I, I want to chat about. Yeah, let's do, uh, let's do that one. next battle so okay front headlock right so I'm bent over like this and his arms around my neck right and I, I'm facing him he's facing me so all I do when when the teacher says go what I do is I just stand right up his arm then is over my shoulder I basically grab the back of his shorts I go up and rock bottom his ass in front of the whole fucking class he's sitting there on his back like trying to breathe I just I'm just up like huh. I walk back it was one of the best fucking moments I like I've scored game winning goals and shots and stuff in sports and, and whatnot that was some of the best fucking karma I've been a part of in my life cause dude was a fucking bully but he never physically did anything and that's why cause I was fit strong it was great Absolutely great. One more fight, let's get into it, and then I'll catch chat, catch up on chat. Oh man, to this day that was so fucking fun. And his look when he was trying to catch his breath, like either, <laughs> it wasn't quite as bad as like remember when a uh, Hulk fucking smashes Loki, does the beauty god thing, right? And Loki sitting there like uh, it was kind of like that. Not as bad. Like, I didn't want to hurt him, hurt him. But that dude, fucking, he, he always kind of gave me a side eye. He wasn't really that vocal anymore when the bullying shit started happening. You know what I mean? So, all right, let's catch up on chat before we go into the story here. All right, Elizabeth from grade five to 678, uh, grade nine. Bully, wish we were friends. 
Did harm I would help others, yeah. Call a nerd, you're good in math, science, art, home ac. I wasn't good in school at all, <laughs> personally. You think nerd was an insult, now I embrace it. Yeah, at the end of the day, it's like, dude, I like what I like. And there's lots of other people who are actually in that shit too. It's more popular than fucking people, like, knew about back in the day. Now with the internet, people know. Right? So. You were all the one in the class? Okay, yeah. The wood shop, yeah. The wood shop is fun. I didn't get to do it that much. Alright, and Camino, so. Your power move is a kid getting close to the rest of your bullies family. You had to take them down the moment they started harassing you badly. Nice. That's some cerebral shit right there, Camino. Love it. Nice. Oh, we got reels back. Doing great, bro. Appreciate it, man. So you end up running across the street with your brother to go find your uncle. We ran home. Didn't learn many years later that your cousins found who this was. Could beat you up. Broke his house. Took him to the parks. <laughs> it was a kid with glasses. Like, dude, you're trying to be a bully and you got glasses? <laughs> oh, my word. All right, let's pop into this town here. Ba -da -da, the massa! Da -da -da -da. Oh, wow, we don't see many travelers around here. Let's have a look at your stuff. Welcome! Ba, ba, ba. Ooh! Ba, da, da, da. Uh, we don't need darts. Not a heavy lance. I will get a Hawkeye, though. We'll get a Morningstar, though. It's equip. Ba, ba, ba. Do, 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 do. Okay, good. I love the remake of this song. This is really nice and peaceful. So, eventually his mom want to charge you for assault? <laughs> your child didn't know your cousins did that. You're in the earliest to address this. Hey, I'm sitting here at school, Billy. You know my daughter's being picked on a bull in case. Stephanie did this? You can share lots that scared because... I could see, you know what, because Stephanie kind of shared with me what she did when she was in the military. That's crazy cool. That she fucking did that. Better can't get over this insane metal remix to marriage song? Dude, you've been improving for years, bro. You know how to protect yourself, the young couple, you helped them. Nice, Elizabeth. Never forget seeing how high you could kick. <laughs> nice. Welcome. All right, um, one golden shield. No! I already have two Genji gloves! Am I that much of a fucking idiot? Genji glove? Genji glove! I am a flipping idiot! Oh, God. All right, uh, Tiara? Sure. Done. Oh, that's actually better. Uh, so defense, 22, 20, and 2. 22, 15. Oh, I'll see with Tiara. Oh, Mystery Veil, though. What? Oh, shit, done. A Power Sash. Da, 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 da. Wow, there's so much good shit here. 52, 35. Yo. Power Sash goes hard, though. 55-37. I'm going Gaia Gear on one. And Power Sash on two. Okay, hold up. We gotta quit some shit here. What? I didn't get a half for him? What? Gaia Gear or Power Sash? Yeah, buddy. There we go. Did they have like... Right, I got a tiara, didn't I? No. 
Right, a mystery veil. I got one. Right, only she can equip it though, that's why. Look at all the green, I love the green here. Oh, we got a bot? Hold up, what, is it my Botrix? Oh, so that can be a... I gotta fix that on my Botrix. <laughs> so, you know what, can you ignore that from Botrix, okay? Just ignore that. <laughs> You left New York, just haven't been back to school system there since. Fair enough, Penny. Go through the entire slot with Faithful Melt and Mediocre and send the real second part. Tempo's maintained. Like I said, Bender, send my way, bro. I sound like a high school gossip queen for a second. <laughs> Shh. I'm really not into drama. 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 Do you believe me now? Heh. <laughs> school. school. Your mother went to her brother's to sell her yelling and so every teacher in the building knew who your family was. Oh shit, yikes. Mom really to show up to school in military uniform? Nice. Yeah, I gotta talk to my Botrix and put it in its place. Bender trends into a slow version of me tempo. Damn, you're fighting Bowser. <laughs> nice. Move to Virginia, live the majority of your life here. That's quite of a move from New York to Virginia. I gave the high school Valley Girl vibes. If you're like, oh my God, Stephanie did what? I can't believe it. Oh my God. Sounds good, Bender. Send it my way, bro. Oh, it wasn't deleted, um, Camino. It, it just warns you. That's all. It's just a warning. So don't stress. Actually, I don't have to go in here. I already bought shit. Listen, I should tell you. Uh, no, never mind. Tell me what? Tell me what, lady? Espers, what in the world are those? If there's some kind of beast, you should ask the old man who lives on the edge of town. Do, 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 do. Welcome. Uh, we got some... I don't know why they still sell the sprint shoes when you can sprint by default. <laughs> we already got a bunch of these, so I think we're good. How did the... How did the... They have graves over there. I don't, Wow. The innkeeper doesn't like strangers. Always overcharges them. Oh, I guess I'll wait then. Oh, we're not going to talk to you yet. <laughs> You're not getting in here. They've changed what that kid says. In the original game, the kid goes full Beavis and Butthead. <laughs> Fire, 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 fire. That's all I'm going to say about that. Ooh, green cherry. Huh, where did that voice come from? Fire! Fire! Uh-oh. Uh what I tell ya? Bop, bop. Elder's house. Hello, Elder. Welcome, welcome. Magic? What's that? That's how you play it, huh? That's how you about to play it? Bop, bop, bop. How much is he going to charge us? You're outsiders. It's gonna cost you fifteen hundred dollars if you want to stay here. Kid, I'm charging you for arson. <laughs> fire! Fire! <laughs> you wish that pain your would go away. I agree, Elizabeth. I, I wish there's something that could be done to help. That <laughs> dude is a chaotic neutral D D player in training. <laughs> nice. You know, some laptops, computers, or phones sometimes only type in capital. Yeah, that's true. That's true, Elizabeth. It's annoying. What brings you young folks to see me? An elderly gentleman who has spent his whole life pursuing the secrets of monsters. Huh. Is there anyone new in the chat here? 
I'm just gonna scroll through here. Benders, it's gonna be you, sir. Benders, it's gonna be you. <laughs> there you go. Canadian version of David Attenborough? That is a fucking compliment. No, I, I'm nowhere near that level. I mean, I can, I can turn on the radio voice if I need to. <laughs> but, uh, no, I, that's a huge compliment. Thank you. It's you. Espers, eh? Huh, haven't heard that word in years. So you know about Espers? No, can't say I do. Don't know a thing. Not one thing. Something's fishy here. Grandpa! Hey! What do you think you're doing, young missy? In her pictures, she captures everything. Forests, water, lights, the very essence of the things she paints. Now, Camino, I don't know if I've had you in a game. Would you be okay if you, I had you as Realm? Let, give me a yes or no, and if it's no, that's fine. If it's yes, cool. Camino, let me know if it's okay if, if you're Realm. Oh, she, she's nominee? <laughs> Absolutely, let's go. Let's go. Grandpa, who are they? Are they friends? Can they use magic too? Shh. Oh, what a cute doggy. Back off, he bites. Go back to your room. Why don't you go to my room? You never let me have any fun. Oh, I know Namine. Don't worry, Paddy. Because I said so. Now shoot. Strago's got that legit, like, angry. <laughs> Fine. Oh, Interceptor's going with. Oh dear, she seems to have taken liking to your dog. Huh. <clears throat> that child. My apologies. It's fine. He usually doesn't take to other people, though. Anyhow, I'm terribly sorry, but I really don't think I can be of any help to you folks. Uh, I, I see. We're just your ordinary, quiet little village. You're not going to find anyone who knows about these Esper things here, I'm afraid. Not in the Massa. Huh... There's something strange about this place. Let's have a look around the village. Uh, thanks for your time. Sorry I couldn't be more helpful. Interceptor. Bye-bye. Oh, the dog <laughs> he said bye-bye back. <laughs> Cute. But yeah, at some point, we will be doing the Kingdom Hearts series on stream. Absolutely, we will. It has been so many years since I've played through what... Oh, God. So we will be doing Kingdom Hearts. I have I have uh, beaten Kingdom Hearts 1 and 2, and I've played almost beaten 350 over two days. So that's my history with the series. Grandma's giving you Yen Sid vibes? <laughs> His voice is elegant, but we already have a K David Ambrose. David Suzuki. Yeah, facts. Yeah, Absolutely. Up, up, up. I, I I don't remember if they actually had the graveyard there in the original one or not. Hmm. All right. Well, let's just go sleep. Love the gameplay. Hate the story though. What a Kingdom Hearts. 
One gil per night. Why not relax for a spell? Dude dropped from 1,500 to one. All we had to do was talk to some people in town, man. Crazy. Kingdom Hearts story is such a mess. Well, let's... We'll get there. Apparently, there's a Kingdom Hearts 4 going to be coming out. I haven't even played 3 yet. What annoyed me the most about Kingdom Hearts, guys, is the fact that they made different installments multi-platform. I don't care if you want to be multi-platform. I don't gatekeep that shit. But the fact that they went multi-platform on handheld... Like, Kingdom Hearts 1 was there. Then Chain of Memories was Game Boy Advance. Then, P then they went back to the PS2 for Kingdom Hearts 2. Then they put 350 over two days on the 3DS. And then they put the fucking other one on the PSP. Like, do you want us to buy every fucking platform to play your fucking story that I'm hooked on, assholes? <laughs> anyway. Uh, we're gonna have a sleep here. Before we do, I need to refill my drink. Shit's gonna go down here in a minute. In, like, we've been kind of chatting a lot, and I've loved every second of it. Shit's gonna get heavy in the game here in, in on the other side. So, feel free to re refill any snacks or drinks you guys got going on. Alright, we'll be back in a couple of moments here to watch shit go down. Uh, keep chatting with each other, guys. In the uh, the break screen, the chat's still live, so feel free to chat with each other, too. Um, yeah, appreciate you. We'll see you on the other side. Alrighty, my friends, thanks so much for your patience. Sorry, it took a little bit longer than normal. I had a little bit of a spill. <laughs> I was too uh, excited to refill my drink there. Yeah, a little bit of a problem. But uh, we're all clean, we're all good. And, uh... You're, yeah, I think, Camino, you're right. It was regular DS. I don't know why I said 3DS. Let's, uh, spend a dollar a night and relax for a spell. Hopefully the Wi-Fi is good and the Continental Breakfast is good for a dollar a night. I don't know. But it should be good because they charge everyone else 1500 We're regulars now. We're part of the town. Aww. Thank you, Elizabeth. Glad to be back. And hello to everybody. Whoa. You gotta help Camino. She's... Something happened to Camino? Yes, she was on fire. And then the flames spread to the neighbor's house and... Oh, I can't even think straight anymore. Please, you have to help her. Infinite. He is out cold, man. He's done. <clears throat> oh. Interceptor. <laughs> Where are you? He's, he's more concerned about his dog. Fire in the village. Gee. I wonder what happened. Kid. Eh, my house. Brat. Fire in the village. Camino's in there. Yikes. Camino! What are you doing? Flames be gone! Yo, the animation improvement is awesome. Magic is forbidden. Magic? I don't care. Camino's inside. Flames be gone. Mayor. All right. Stand back. The gig is up. As they say. Oh, can't forget the one last old lady. <laughs> I don't know if the flames are going to be gone. They're going pretty strong. That kid didn't get. Oh my god, it did not like that. I still use the fire, it's too strong. They're storing an awful lot of flame rods in there. I'm going in. Wait, I'll go with you. 
Count me in too. I'm not gonna let an old geezer go in there on his own. Who are you calling a geezer? I'm only 70 and fit as a fiddle. Geezer, he says. Uh oh. Quickly! Burning home. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. The geezer kind of fits if you look at his face. <laughs> you know? He, I mean, if the, the shoe fits. Oh, I should have bought a. Oh, no. Shit. All right. Um, what do we give him for this? Cast regen? Eh. Boost the magic player. Eh. I don't care about strength, really. Magic plus two. And let's go with... Give me haste, why not? Now, let's see your abilities, sir. So, he already has lore. Let's give him... Shiva, just to get this done. Okay. Here we go, guys. The fire's spreading fast. Looks like this house could collapse any second. We have to hurry and find Camino. Balloon. A back attack? That sucks. We ran right into it. Good thing I have. Actually, we have Aqua Breath. Bunch of angry fucking pumpkins. <laughs> Yo, Aqua Breath looks fucking sick. What? I didn't know they updated the animation for his lore spells. That's sick. Oh wow, I'm excited now. I might act. Ooh, okay. Okay. Hold on, let's try a little something here. A little something, something. What's up, Tyvee? Good to see you. Oh, the masters are so impressive. Like, I've never been excited for Aqua Breath in my life, and now this? Plus, even Diamond Dust, like, the general animation is the same. It looks the same as the, the Super Nintendo, but just that the smoothness of the animation is like, oh, yeah, it looks good. How you doing, by the way? Welcome to the stream. It's good to see you again. Cheers. I'll fight you too. Uh oh. Damn. Ba -da -ba 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 -da -ba 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 -ba. This could get bad pretty damn quick. Let's, uh, hold on. Here, let's do lore, aqua breath on those guys, and we will do Lazara on these two. Whew, there we go. We should be able to get through this nicely now. Just the spell animation updates. I'm just, I'm here for it, uh, Tyvee. Like, it's so good. So, Bender's learned Blizzard. Stepped in their bio for some confused. Hey, everyone's moving on up in the world. This is great. Want to fight? You fire person. Let's just do regular fire. Let's do I have just regular blizzard. No need to like waste all of our magic. <coughs> we should learn imped. How's he doing right now anyway? With his abilities. Uh, I almost saw it float right now. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Not where you use that very often. Ba, 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 ba. Got him. Tyvee, how you been doing? What have you been up to? How's life? What games are you playing right now? I think it's been like a week or so sweet. I've uh, been lucky enough to have you on stream a week or two. 
I love the Magicite bonus 10% HP boost. I'll mess you up too. You cannot run from me. Ooh, six of them. Beautiful. No, I'm not gonna do it. Let's just get it done. I don't want to fuck with them, but. <laughs> don't hurt me, I'm an old man! Aha! Let's do a little cure here just in case. Uh -huh. Bop. All's well, so playing Final Fantasy on uh, iOS. How is that, by the way? iOS, so, like, you're playing Final Fantasy on, like, the mobile, like, the mobile one, right? Uh, except, you're, this is an Android, but on your iPhone or, like, iPad? Is that right? How's that going? I personally, I don't, I usually don't like playing games on touchscreens, but unless you have, I know you could probably pair a controller to it, though, right? Like a Bluetooth controller? Something like that, right? There we go. Now he's learned Blizzara. There we go. Now, let's get him off that. Abilitas. I suppose. What else is there? I think there's Cure in there or something. Uh, oh, Rasp, Osmos, and Cure. Never mind. We'll keep him on there. Let's get Rasp and Osmos out of the way. Oh, shit. I forgot about that. Don't surround me. No. <laughs> okay. Actually, we're a little bit low on... Let's... Do a little cure here. There we go. And now you use Lazara and um you guys as well. But I've been doing okay. It's uh, work has been really challenging lately. Very very challenging work. So these game like stream sessions at the end of the day just make make things a lot more relaxing for me. You know. So it's it's definitely been good though. Now, can we go in? Oh, I'm an idiot! Why would I... Hello, McFly! I'm an idiot! I can't believe I did that! Now you know it's true when I say I haven't played this game in like 20 years. Like, I'm doing shit like that. You know I'm real. <laughs> On your iPhone. Haven't ran any issues. Yes, you can pair a controller very if I... By a backbone? A backbone, that's still like the controller that you can put on the side of it, right? Do you actually have one of those? Alright, here we go. Lots of fires to fight. I can't help, but I just gotta do Aqua Breath. It looks so cool. <laughs> just blast him with water. It's great. Beautiful thing. Turn your phone to PSP. Yeah, okay. I've seen a lot. Yeah, I've seen those accessories. That's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Bop. For me, there's just not too many uh, mobile games that I would play. And any mobile games I would play, I can emulate, or I already own for console. But I get, yeah, there's like, here, I'm, I'm saying this is a 42-year-old guy who's been alive since the, all these games came out. So for people who are younger, like, or who just haven't played them before, or they just want to, it's just, it's a good option. That is a good option. Magic plus one. Oh, almost done there. Uh, 100%. Great. That's a beautiful thing. Uh, what are we doing here? Raswell's Michelle. Bismarck. Yeah, let's do Bismarck. Fuck it. How are we doing with uh, Katoru Paz? Uh, so we're on death. No, not that one yet. Oh, shit. They respawned. Ah! Ba, 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 ba. Hmm. 
No, don't hit me! Hmm. Get in the 1000s there. Nice. Match that to HP 10%. Love to see it. Love to see it. A flame rod. Ha <laughs> ha. Yes. It'll be perfect in our fight against the flames. Don't care. You are dead now. La 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 la. Fire and thunder, hey! But actually, we we learned in one battle. Beautiful. Uh, so Bismarck is already done, except for rays. But we get rays from someone else, can we not? I swear we can. No, 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 no. no, no, no. Is it Phantom? Who is it? I forgot. Oh, I swear we get raised from someone else. Kieran, yes. No. No. Oh, oh, well, my bad. Anyway, let's go with Mad One. <laughs> I'll just fight one more of these guys. I, I won't fight the other guy. We'll move on. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Lost your collections, I've been emulator playing off ports, so I have no system in the laptop here. Oh, I hear you. I'm sorry to hear that uh, you lost your collections. That sucks. That's tough, man. I'm sorry to hear that. I look back on some of the games that I had, and I feel freaking mad that I don't have them anymore. I, I can't even remember how and when I gave up my Intellivision, my Atari, my NES. I still have my SNES, I still have my N64. Um, I have my PS2, I have my PSP, I have my 3DS, I have my Advance, but, oh man, I can't remember, uh, that, I, I feel that, that hurt. Use Delta to play old uh, Nintendo, you can emulate anything in Dreamcast. Okay, there you go, yeah, so you got a lot of options still, that's good, that's good. I would love to get an updated PC, because then I can emulate a lot of other PS2 games and stuff, and stream those for y'all. I really, oh man. Anyway, what was I doing again? Bop. He needs also, he's getting low on. There we go. Right, she's done now, right? No, nope, almost there. But wait, there's more. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Bye, flames. Nice, definitely final or death. <laughs> Let's get that out of the way. Not that we even use that often, but I just like to have the 100% of it, you know what I mean? Okay. Mm, slip slide slow, okay. Mm. Reflect and haste are, are probably kind of nice. I think we'll go with that. Fully done there. Let's go Unicorn. Right, because he's mastered almost everything else. Shit. Except for Carbuncle. Carbuncle is in use, though. Who has Carbuncle? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't care about Drain. Yeah, we might as well. Ooh. I like Asuna as well, though. Hmm. I guess, yeah, it's going to be a unicorn. Nope. <laughs> nope, not yet. <laughs> I remember that much.
Ice Rod. There we go. Ha <laughs> ha. A rod of ice. I shall attack. Let's kick some ice. That's the cheesy joke in... What Batman is it? That's Char uh, uh, George Clooney. And uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger's in it. With all the cheesy puns. And he's got nipples on his bat suit for fuck's sake. Yeah. There we go. Moving on. Now, before we go, we just need a little bit of uh, HP, uh, MP. There we go. I, you know what? I think we're good with that. Let's just go with it and see how we do. Is this what started the blaze? No, it was the fucking kid. You know it was the kid. It wasn't this thing. This thing just became part of the blaze and decided to, like, take it over after it happened. That kid was the fucking culprit. Flamita! Bop, bop, bop. Oh, this shit's done, though, bro. Stop it. Da, 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 da. I love the fucking guitar that comes in on this remake. Batman Robin, thank you, Elizabeth. Appreciate that. Oh shit, he comes back hard. <gasps> oh no! Oh no! Hold up, hold up. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I feel like that that fucking TikTok or the YouTube short where they took the ape from uh, Planet of the Apes. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> That's me right now. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Shit! Oh, we're oh, we're in trouble. Holy shit! Fuck! That came out of nowhere. Let's get some. Let's get some buffs on here. <laughs> I forgot the strat on this guy. I was like, let's go all in, and they're like, nah, you can't do that, bro. Uh, protect, stop. Do I have shell? Let's do that. Uh, da, 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 da. Okay, I feel a little bit better now. That would that got me off guard. Nice, we just rare with Blizzard then. Let's keep the bombs or the balloons alive. I'll wait. Wait for it. You might be a flame eater, but I got some fire. I, let's, let's just attack. Because I got ice shit on my weapons. Let's just attack. Okay, that was the key. I think my aqua lore, like, like as soon as you kill all the shit, it comes back with a super hard counterattack. And then we stop doing it, and it's like, cool. We're good. 8 AP, baby. Let's go. I, I learned shit, but... Camino, where are you? Interceptor! She's over here. We know. Oh no, we're too late. Oh shit. Now the dogs try and say it's uh, protect us here. Hey, it's our guy. Let's go, it's infinite. Because that's what he does. He's just fucking badass like that. Time to get out of here. Are you okay? Yeah, thanks, Grandpa. These folks are the ones who you should be thanking. Thank you. 
I guess our little secret is out now. Everyone in this village can use magic, can't they? So, what is this place? This is the village of the Magi. A long, long time ago, humans used Magicite to acquire magical powers. Those who gained this ability came to be known as the Magi. I didn't think there were any Magi left in the world. After the War of the Magi, the Espers fled to the New World beyond the Sealed Gate. They wished to live in peace, without fear of their powers being used by others. That left only humans in this world, and the ordinary ones feared the Magi's power. The horror of the war was still fresh in their minds. That fear soon sparked an Inquisition. Magi were hunted down and executed. Oh, there were trials, of course, but they were merely for show. Even though the only difference was that they could use magic? The few who managed to escape took up shelter here. They were our ancestors. Our powers have weakened as our magi blood has thinned, but they remain in some form or another. Well, if you're up to it, do you think you'd be willing to help us? You said you were looking for some espers, right? Well, I do owe you one for saving Camino. I'll help you find your espers. I want to go too! I think not, young lady. Buddy duddy. But where do we start? Hmm. If they came this way, they may be hiding in the mountains to the west. Why there? Well, those mountains are teeming with magical energy. According to legend, they're a sacred place to the espers. Perhaps the magic drew them there after they went berserk. It's worth a look. There we go. Buddy Duddy. <laughs> She's such a kid. She's like off in the corner, like, hmm, solely sulking. Ba da da, ba da da, ba ba ba. Don't get the wrong idea. I just wanted my dog back. You're leaving? I'll search for the espers in my own way. Like, what are we going to do? Say no? <laughs> Interceptor. Aw. Alright, let's make sure our boy uh, here is strapped up. Now, he already has an ice rod. So there's no need to... Do oh, he's a morning star? That's a big upgrade for him. Yeah, okay, we'll buy it for you. We have tons of fucking cash, so... <clears throat> da, da. Da, 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 da. Wow, I can't really get too much uh, headgear for this guy. Guy gear, though. Yeah, I think we're good on the stuff we got. I think I'm going to keep some of this stuff, though. Just in case. 
Oh, yo, I forgot we had ultimate weapon. What? I think we might need some of the stuff. I'm just gonna hold off on this. Hold up. Hold up. Oh, he can't use ultimate weapon? What? How come he can't use ultimate weapon? We were able to equip that shit before. I am so confused. Unless, hold on. Someone else has it equipped, right? They got to. They got to. I think they do, right? Alright, well, let's not have to dwell on it for now. Uh, let's go buy some stuff, because we did use some items. Kamino isn't really Bender's grandchild. I heard she's a friend's daughter. That's only a rumor, though. Ooh, we got some, uh, some of the tea there. Okay, we have him with Madwin right now? Okay. Okay, we're not going there yet. Let's get uh, Strago, or Benders, with uh, his goodies. Yo! 4,000? God! Bah, what? That stone attack, when Gao was doing it earlier in, like, episode 2 or whatever, that thing is, like, oh my god. What? <clears throat> what? I gotta try that shit again. That's crazy. Let's see. Two of them. Oh, that barely did fuck all there. I don't know what happened there. Disappointed, Benders. Attacked that much in a while. Nice. <clears throat> Dude, our attacks are pretty good too. Stephanie learned to reflect. Da, da, da. So we're going on haste and uh, teleports. Okay, cool. Oh, should we go all the way up here? Well, not that far. <clears throat> Let's see if death works. Let's try it. Can't yeah, hurt, right? Break. A lot of these are like instant death, but whatever. Ba -ba. Couple more, and then our boy will be ready to go. Oh shit, a devout that's a chimera. Yeah, it is. Holy shit. <clears throat> you know what? I'm not I'm just gonna <clears throat> This thing terrifies me, bro. <laughs> 
Nice! Like, if I aim for one, it hits for fucking 4,000. If I try and mix it up, it doesn't hit 4,000 over three. It just goes down to like 200 apiece. So, if, if we have a powerful enemy, that's our, our key right there. That's our game plan right there. Nice. Alright, next battle, we got it. Next battle, we got it. Shit, Bender says. Aww. So cute, he's all by himself. <laughs> Bitch! You fucking not- Man, that's bullshit. Ah, uh, haha, -ha, there he goes. Turn everything how you want. Uh, you went on making the original Mario music. It made a very short melody and went too far. Why? Well, I, I guess it's always good to be kind of improving on yourself, but don't count yourself out on what you did, right? Just enjoy what you had, and if you want to remake it, then yeah, just don't mess up this one. Just, just yeah. <laughs> Build off it, I guess what I'm trying to say here. Ba, ba, ba. All right, a little savey save. If only my Russian folk music. <laughs> Moscow, Moscow. Da, 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 da. <laughs> okay, uh, let's switch Espos to Golem. Yeah, protect, stop, and cure. I like that. Fun. How is our Stephanie doing with Carbuncle? She is getting along. How is Christian doing with Unicorn? Uh, getting there. All right, let's go. A healing rod. A rod that heals, bro. Hey! Steve, what, what are you doing away from home? Bad girl. Okay, I kind of forget where to go here in this place. Veno Benu. I... I like the names they had in the SNES. I don't know why they switched them up. Probably because the translation switched around a little bit, but... These are mischievous looking birds, by the way. They're, they look like they got some plans up their sleeves, you know what I mean? Feather dust? Oh, it poisoned me, you asshat! So not cool, bro. <laughs> what? Yo, there's so many ins and outs this place. Nope, not going there. Okay, so we know exactly where we're not supposed to go right now. Because that moves the story on. Ugh, Bonacons? They look like nasty caterpillars. Alright. They look like those grubs that Pumba would eat from Lion King. Kill them all. Nice. Asuna. Hold on. I feel like we can jump around in here somehow. Let's go back. Hold on. Hold on. Wait a minute. There's a way to get up there. I forget what it is, though. How? There's, like, there's jumps. I'm so annoyed right now. Okay, we'll come back to it. We'll come back to it. I only turned the uh, encounter block just, like, when, I, when I'm exploring, I want to focus on, actually, what I can do there. And not get interrupted. But I do, like, want to fight, because I want to level up, obviously. But yeah, usually when I turn encounters off, it's just to, so I can explore something I'm trying to get uh, more details on. Like I said, guys, it's been over 20 years since I played this, so bear with me. <laughs> really, Benders? Come on, man, hit that shit. 
And Christian, too. He miss he's missing shit, too. <laughs> oh, a bridge. I forget about that. Like I said, guys, it's tough because I forget where all this shit goes. Another bridge? Okay. You're distracted by a pretty flower? Haha, <laughs> that's fair. That's fair. Mandrake. Drake, he looking like a man. I like these plants on fire. Yo, that's not cool. Is that Rasp? Oh, no, okay, that was, that was light. Okay. Nice, have to learn haste, very good. Abilities, uh... Okay, almost fully uh, set there. Oh, we're back here, bro, go to the same spot. Oh, shit. Well, fuck that, then. Okay, we're going the right way. <laughs> I want that. I need that. See, I need to be able to get... I forget how to get there. Bonacon, Adamantcurry. It's almost like Adamantua, but it's, except it's not. These, these things are far from the Adamantua as we know in the current uh past. We have for 47? Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Now you must die. Now you must die. I hate that move where they fucking snort you. Because now Stephanie doesn't get any of the XP. Or the AP. That fucking sucks. So annoying. Alright. Mm, yeah, we're good. Are these statues of the Warring Triad? The Warring Triad? There's writing chisel logs in these things. So, uh, what's this Warring Triad? They're the legendary gods who created the power we know as magic. So they're the gods of magic. Yeah, you could say that. This place is brimming with magic. Those three gods are the creators of magic, meaning they also created the espers. It's said that the espers once enshrined images of the gods in a holy place. This must be it. The espers must have been drawn here by the magic of these statues. So what happens to the gods after they made the espers? Supposedly, they tired of fighting and turned themselves into stone. Legend has it they can be found beyond the sealed gate resting in their eternal slumber. I wonder if their magic is what connects the gate to the Esper world. Hmm. If the Espers were drawn here by these statues, they could just be up ahead. It's worth a look. That sneaky girl, man. In reverence toward the gods were these statues made, and in prayer that their power would ne'er again be stirred. Let them serve as a warning to future generations of the three, go three gods who once descended from the heavens. The Dawn of Magic. Oh, okay, hold up. Three gods descended from the heavens. Fearing one another's power, the gods began to war. Those mortals caught amongst their fighting became espers and were forced to fight endlessly as slaves to the gods. Realizing their power begotten naught but strife, the gods at last agreed to seal away their strength. With the last of their fading magic, the gods returned the Esper's free will, then turned themselves into stone. The last words they left to the Esper's were these, Never must we be woken. Whoa, shit! 
I forgot about Ultros. <laughs> These shiny golden statues are all mine. Now I'll finally be able to get some respect from Siegfried. Ooh, they're all glowy and sparkly. So pretty. Hey, Squid Brain, don't you ever learn? Well, Mama always said I was a slow learner, but at least I never give up. I don't like that. The original game, the original game basically said, I, 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 Mama always says I'm a slow learner, but I eat fast, as in he's like, he's going to eat us up. What he said there is, it's not as intimidating. I'm kind of disappointed, actually. Is this the end of recreating songs by ear? Have I cheated by looking up guitar tutorials? I wouldn't say tutorials are cheating. It's just, uh, they're lesson plans. They're, they're ways that you can self-teach yourself. That's my opinion, though, Benders. Thought you wouldn't see me again? I've got more lives than I do arms. You ain't out of my grasp yet. Dude, we're gonna light you the fuck up. Ah, locked. Ultros, come on, buddy. What are you doing here, bro? You're not even, like, put up a fight. He was actually... He's a weird one. He's actually the hardest. At the be the first time you fight him, he, that's his hardest. Legit. Uh-oh, he speed himself up. Do I have slow? Man, that was cheap. Sorry, so sorry. That's slow. Watch me reverse this. Come on, baby. Come on. Yes! <laughs> Talk about cheap. You slow now, bro. Ooh, okay, okay. You're pulling that. I got you. I got you. Now back the fuck up. Now you're slow down. And... I'm curing myself. Ba -da -ba 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 -da -ba -ba -ba. 12 90. We're lighting this fucking thing up. Where's the calamari, baby? Oh. I ain't scared. Grandpa, I followed you here. Camino, I thought I told you to stay home. I wanted to practice my drawing. I'm a budding virtuoso after all. Hey there, what's your name? How dare you ask you my name? As if anyone wouldn't already know the great Ultros. A pint-sized virtuoso? and an egotistical octopus. Do I even want to know what's next? I've seen enough hentai to know where this is going. And I just realized she's under age, bro. When I first played this game in grade six, I had no idea what hentai was. I didn't know about tentacle stuff and the whole like it didn't it wasn't a thing here in North America anyway it had been going on in Japan for years so this just takes on so much more of a creepy fucking meaning realm is a kid Fucking hell. Yeah. Hey, Ulti. Why don't you pose so I can draw your picture? Uh, Ulti? The nerve of this brat. Look, I'm not one of your kitty friends, and I don't want a stinking portrait. Forget it then. 
I didn't want to draw your picture anyway. It's okay. I'll just jump off this ledge. Then everyone will be happy. No, Kamino, don't jump! How dare you tease a little girl like that? If anything happens to her, I'm not going to forgive you. Uh, I, I mean, I, I, I didn't... Uh, well, gee, what, what do you want me to do? Let her draw your picture. Maybe she'll even make you look good. Uh, I'm not cut out for this sort of thing. <sighs> All right. Uncle Ulti really, really wants you to draw his picture. <laughs> You're gonna love it. Enough chatter, Camino. Get over here. All this time, it's like... <laughs> we have to pause. We're cooking this dude with like 1,300, 1,400 fire 2 or fire, fire uh, spells. And we pause, he's like, well, what do you want me to do, guys? <laughs> like, he should want her to jump off the cliff. Bro, like, what, like, this is like, oh, come on, Ultros, bro. You, this is where you lost it, my guy. You lost it. Ultras, Ultras, his body composition. Use elemental attacks at your own risk. That's all right, we'll cure ourselves. We missed? Shit. Oh, he tried to kill her. <laughs> Hold up, uh, do I have haste? I hope I have haste. Please, please, please. No? Fuck. I have haste? No. All right. Oh, at least we're full health. Paste. No, not ink. There it is. There we go. Come on, Realm. Let's get it done. Come on, Camino. Kimino slash realm. Like, this is the whole point of the battle, is to show off her skill, and it's not working. <laughs> there we go! How can this be? I'm just a... washed up old octopus. Yep. You're done, bro. Hey, did you see me? Wasn't that great? I'd be more way useful than Gramps. Gramps? It wouldn't hurt to bring her along, would it? Oh, all right, already. Not like you stay at home when you're told anyway. Yay! Ha! <laughs> Now, Memento Ring, I forget what that does. Ah, prevents petrification zombie instant death. Nice. Let's also give her some angel wings? No. Eh. Defense. I want something with defense. No, I don't care about strength. Defense. I don't really have anything for that, though. Alright, fine. Fuck it. Let's do, um... There we go. I like that. So mozzarella sticks don't end stream. Nah, dude. We got a little bit more to go. There's, we're going to come to the end here pretty quick. But we're not quite there yet. Uh, how's everyone's abilities going? Esper's uniform? Almost there. Almost got teleport done. Let's get out of the way. Let's 
Save point. Yes. Yo, okay, now I get it. Now I get it. We're good. I remember what's up now. We're good. I now I see this automatically in my memory. Like it's it's all come back to me. Holy shit, dude. <laughs> Do a save point here. Da, 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 da. There we go. Ba, 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 ba. Tabby suit. I forget what that does. Let's find out. Sort items use. <sighs> Tabby suit. A cat suit that negates poison damage. Okay. Hold on. Yo, look at those stats, though. What? What? I, I guess only she, only uh, Realm can have it, or Camino can have it. Oh, wow. Okay. So we're 30. Oh, I can't even memorize this shit. Yeah, she needs it more. She needs it more. That's fine, Elizabeth. We're gonna do our own little uh, bathroom break here again here pretty quick before we go to where we're going. Okay. Do money bags. What do we get? I like trophies. Fair of five hundred thousand dollars since we started. That's fantastic. A chocobo suit. What the fuck does that do, bro? Okay, hold up. So, compared to the tabby suit, chocobo suit, uh, more strength. Magic's down. Defense is up, though. Her attack is 211? How is that possible? God dang. Yeah, I'll give a chocobo suit. Look like a chocobo. Ba 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 ba. All Bizarra, all day, every day, man. With these guys. All day, every day, Bizarra. Done. Let's go. Bender's got some shit in there. Pause? That sounded weird. My bad. Sorry. Uh, let's have a look. Who is he with? Golem? Oh, he got all that shit, didn't he? Yes, he did, baby. Um, He's already got... Shell's one. I'm not... What do we give him? Let's give him Siren, I think. No. No, no. Let's give him... Uh, Shote. I'm going to keep calling it Shote. I like Shote over Ketobulpas. Shote is, is the original name of this Esper back in the day, so that's what we're going to go with. Never forget the first time you said you love your girlfriend? Yo, man, I'm so glad you had some of those moments. I really am, Benders. I really am, bro. I'm excited for your positive progress in life. Let's just say that. Uh, where did him? 100%. Yo, I got Christian with almost everyone 100%. Damn. Damn. I'm gonna give him Phantom. Yeah, there we go. She's doing Mad One, right? Yeah. Uh, Carbuncle. How would you do with Carbuncle? Almost there, all full done. Cool. 
But how do we get whoa, 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 how do we get out of here though? There it is. My bad. Wrong way. The remix of the music here is so fucking good. The the, the main tunes are there, and then they add this background flourish of different instruments that just highlight things so nicely. Ah! My childhood, man. This is my childhood. Asking why about something I was saying about... I decided to drop it on... Oh, wow. Now, to be fair, Benji, you feel he kind of went a little hard fast on it, just because it's the first time we've actually met her in person. Uh, it's kind of like the first weekend he kind of had or like how does she respond i'm curious you don't mind me asking you don't have to share it publicly you can dm me about the stuff you prefer um because we're kind of public here obviously ba, 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 ba. chaos wave Mm. Very nice indeed. Do this one. Oh, I can't go. Oh, shit. No. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, okay, we want to go this way. <laughs> I totally meant to go this way. Yes, yes, that's what we do here. We totally go the way. That I said we wanted to go. I don't know if she's gonna sketch this or not, but fuck it, let's go. Stop hurting us, bro. Get lit. Welcome back, Elizabeth. Digestive fluid. That sounds nasty. This sounds nasty, you know? Ooh, lit up. Let's neither goes to plan. Our first kiss was a random friend because she was scared to at prom. Our first day was awkward too. Dude, being awkward on that shit when you're with someone for the first time, whether it's a first kiss, it's always gonna be awkward. It's never gonna be perfect. And the fact that you're sharing, like you're being vulnerable with each other. That's what makes it cool, in my opinion. Like when you're willing, like that, sharing that vulnerability with each other, that's something you're not sharing with other people. And that in of itself makes her really fucking cool, in my opinion. That I love that shit. It's like I'm being open and vulnerable, and it's awkward, but let's be awkward together and make it into something cool. That's that's how I see it. It's, I, right? Does that makes sense. There's a lightning coming. <laughs> lightning McQueen. I never really watched the Cars uh, franchise. I never really cared for it. I mean, the kids watched some of them, but I never really got into it that much personally. I don't think I, I think it's good. I really do. Alrighty, my friends. I have to do a quick bathroom. Oh, I can't quick. Oh, we'll quick save. A uh, quick bathroom break. Quick drink refill. Um, and then uh, we'll get to the next section here. How you level level five? I don't know, dude. That's really weird. I. I really need to do something with the whole Botrix thing. Like, I don't even know what type of benefits I can give you guys at these levels. They're just, it's just there when I, the reason why I have Botrix is because I want kick people to be able to in like connect with the chat, right? That type of thing. That's why I got Botrix. Botrix is, is the reward program, like the, um, is the bot that allows when someone follow, uh, follows on kick, uh, donates on kick, Resubs on Kate, like that's what will pop the notification. Whereas on Twitch or D Live, uh, there uh, D Live has um, oh god, what is it? I forget. There's a there's a bot service on D Live, so when someone subs on D Live or res or or follows on D Live, it pops up with a, a little graphic, right? And then for Twitch, when someone does it on Twitch, there's a there's um, um, a different service, right? So I have, that sucks to have to use three different services. That way, when someone follows or whatever on one of those platforms, right, there's a little animation. It's like, oh, hey, cool, right? So that's what that's what it's all about. Botrix is the only one that I have turned, like, that has automatically turned on the levels. Uh, the one for Twitch doesn't, and the one for T-Live doesn't at the moment, so. 
Anyway, uh, let's uh, go get a quick uh, bathroom break and drink refill stuff. We'll be back in a minute or two. And I appreciate the shit out of you. That sounds weird. But it's true. See you on the other side. I appreciate you. Thank you. Alrighty, my friends. Thank you very much for your patience. Uh, appreciate it. We are back. She's only got 42. Come on. We gotta get her, like, her level 2 spells here real quick. Let's do that. Come on. What's it gonna do? Poison? That's it? You got poison. Haha. -ha. Let's get Kamini. Oh, what? How did that cure it so much? I didn't know what element her, her fucking attack is. Damn. So she's at 42%. What is she at now? 48%. Uh, no, let's just give it. <clears throat> Is this an Esper? Uh oh. Uh oh. Getting jumped. Uh oh. What are they doing? I had no idea that there were this many. Gramps, take Camino and get out of here. Oh. No, that ain't happening. Getting surrounded. Bro, oh, we're about to fight. Wait! What? What is it? I sense incredible magic power in Stephanie. No, it's more than just magic. I hope she's not going to go ballistic again. What happened? <clears throat> You're different from the others. You possess the same power we do. I can feel it. Yes. You're all young espers from the world beyond the gate, aren't you? Entering this world is forbidden, but we wanted to do something for our friends who'd been turned into Magicite. We all gathered at the gate, and just then, Stephanie appeared. I could feel the strength of your emotions from the other side of the gate. When Stephanie opened the gate for us, we were finally able to escape. But the moment we stepped into your world, we lost all control of our powers. We destroyed an entire city, attacked people who had done no wrong. The same thing happened to me. When that power suddenly stirred inside me, I had no control over it. There must be something in your world that dampens your powers. Freed of those reins, your powers ran wild. It seems even we espers can lose our senses and do unforgivable things. I'm truly sorry. The Empire wants to make peace with you. Why don't you come with us? They would forgive us? Let's head back to Thamasa and meet with General Leo. Right. 
Right? All good. <clears throat> General Leo. Christian, it seems you found the Espers. I owe you a debt of gratitude. I am Leo, a general of the Empire. M might I have your name? I am Yura. What we have done to your people is inexcusable. We are in no position to ask for your forgiveness, but... Oh, speak no further. We do not seek you out to chastise you for past mistakes. It is we who ought to be ashamed. We thought you as only of a means to wage... which to wage war. How close we came to bringing about a second War of the Magi. We must put this all behind us. I think our work is finally done. It looks like true peace is finally upon us. Let's go back to Vector. Elizabeth. Please, don't say anything. Those two are hot and heavy, huh, Grandpa? They're young, dear. <laughs> uh, what? Not everyone's just laughing. Oh, a little Magitech mayhem. Yo, that's your own guys. Okay, and us too. Kefka, what do you think you're doing? <laughs> Emperor's orders. I have to turn all these espers into magicite. Behold, a Magicite Motherload! Yura! Yo, she was trying to run away, too. How pathetic. This little hamlet has too much boring and not enough burning. Torch everything. Kefka, no! Shut up! I have to say that this whole situation is absolutely atrocious. And what the fuck is going on? But I also have to say what the fuck is going on with Leo? Like, bull, dude, you are you do you have cancer right now? Like what is happening to you, sir? He's got gold frosted tips. He's got gold on the collar and gold lips and he is dark as fuck. Well, there's anything wrong with that. It just, what is, like, this, what? Now, I like Leo as a character. Leo is clearly, he is a righteous fucking guy. But what the fuck, bro? They did him dirty like this. They did him dirty like this. A master scroll? What the fuck is a master scroll? All right, well, fuck this. Kefka... It's time to fucking go general versus fucking general here. Kefka, I can no longer stand by while you commit these atrocities. There we go. Ow. Ha, one. Shock, I like it. Ooh, that looks amazing. Shock is also, I don't think there was another move called shock. Was there until Final Fantasy IX when Beatrice, uh, Beatrix did it? I think I might be right on that. 
Any Final Fantasy people can let me know if I'm wrong, but yeah. Let's fucking go. He hit me for 1 HP. Kefka's garbage compared to Leo here. Let's go. Come on, what up, Kefka? I'm gonna shock the shit out of you, boy. Okay, that, that hurt. 91, that's not bad, though. We can still keep going here. Kafka, like, come on, man. Leo's just too strong for you. We're too strong for you, sir. That's what it is. That's the four one I talked about earlier in the stream. I forgot who asked. Was it Kimino? Uh, I forget who asked about it. Or Candy. But that's the one right there. That's what he has. The Master Scroll. That's what it's called. The Master Scroll. It's called something different than the original uh, Final Fantasy uh, 3. Six. But that's the one. He did one, two, three, four. Put a Genji Glove with that. You're doing eight attacks. Ah, oh, beautiful. Ah, Leo. Ever the consummate soldier. Here's the problem. Where are you, Kefka? Show yourself. Problem is, Leo is kind of like Captain America. Very straight and narrow. These are the rules of battle, and I am better than you, and I will win. Kefka is a Magitech Knight. So while he can fight, magic is his specialty. And that's where he's very strong. Emperor Gestal, I need you here. Leo, my liege. I'm sorry I had to deceive you, Leo. It was the only way to get the Magisite. You understand, don't you? But Emperor, don't say anything. I understand how you feel. <laughs> That's right. Our top priority is collecting Magisite now. But my liege, then what have I been fighting for? Leo, I'd like you to take a well-earned rest. A very, very long rest. <laughs> what? You thought you actually hit me? That was an illusion, just like my guest on. You really are a slow one. And always, always, always such a goody two-shoes. Kevda. Say. <laughs> I'll tell your liege I had to dispose of a traitor. Die, die, die. Uh-oh. What is this? I feel tremendous power. Wave after wave of pure magical energy. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. They coming out now, straight out the woodwork. <coughs> Bahamut, hang on, we're coming to help. Fenrir, hurry. Shiva, faster. Unicorn, Bismarck, Carbuckle, Phantom. They're all breaking out now, man. They're coming. Full send. I love this first person view of the world and it scrolls so nicely. 
it looks even better on this. Like, it still looked really good on the Super Nintendo, don't get me wrong. It was impressive for the time. But man, oof. Oh, you all showed up for my party! I wasn't expecting you guys, gals, oh, whatever. But I'm so happy to see you. After all, you've brought me more presents. And they're all just what I wanted. Magicite. Well, I wouldn't want to turn you down after you've come all this way. First, let's neutralize those pesky powers of yours. Yo, he, he even took out his own magic check arbor, guys. Now, little espers, let's see those presents. He's just taking them all out and converting them into magic, basically killing them almost. <laughs> you want to take me on? Fine, here I am. Ifrit? We already got Ifrit. The spells don't even hit him. He even got fire off. Oh, the big one. That cured him. It cured him. Thought you could defeat me? How oh, rich! <laughs> Come to me, my Magicite pretty. Come and help me build the Magic Empire of Kepka. <laughs> Ooh, it's warm to the touch. What a lovely treasure. What a joke. I didn't know you experts were such wimps. This isn't even fun. Time to wrap things up. Yo, he just, just like, yeet. Brings them all in. Like, Kefka is powerful. <laughs> this should be plenty of magicite. No, all I need to do is claim that final treasure beyond your precious sealed gate. I just can't believe it! Sid, when Sid made him, he made him as powerful as Elizabeth, but the mental shit was just fucked up, as you can see here. So, dude fucking assassinated Leo. Because Leo was pure. He was a pure soldier. He's like, listen, I'm going to do things by letter. And I believe in the Empire. And I'm going to fucking win and beat you. Because we're better and we want... Here's our objectives. Leo never got Magicite treatment. Ever. He was a pure soldier. He didn't need that to be strong. Which is what Kefka was alluding to. He was like, you're such a goody two-shoes. He was. He was just on the wrong side. You know? And once the corruption of Kefka and apparently Emperor Gestal came into play, even he was betrayed. General Leo. Even though he had the weird fucking skin tone and gold lips. People only seem to want power, don't they? Do they really want to be like me? I wanted you to teach me so much more. Uh-oh. Interceptor. That's a nasty wound. Not only Leo, but Infinite too? Curse the Empire. I'll have to do for now, buddy. I guess they patched him up. Oh, you're so sweet. Don't worry. Your friend Kamina will take care of you. Now I'm worried about Lou and the others back at the Empire. I hope they're alright. 
Yeah, we got our friends back at Vector. So if we got betrayed... What? This got fixed? The Espers took this out, though. Okay, I guess they got fixed. We've been had. The Emperor is a liar. It was all a trap. Thanks to King Lua, we managed to escape before the trap was sprung. Good work, Lou. Blayu bought us tea, tipped me off to the whole crooked plot. I barely finished seeing she pleasantries with her when she just blurted it out. Pleasantries? Do you think I could be so rude as to meet a lady and not make any moves at all? It's a matter of courtesy here. Dear brother, courtesy! Playboy. General Leo's dead. Kefka murdered him. Sir Leo dead? What a terrible waste. He was one of the few people in the Empire who truly understood. Sign is the one guy who would definitely understand Leo. We need to rethink our plans. Let's return to the airship. Would you mind if I accompanied you? And you would be? Uh, he's from this village. He's a, a descendant of the Magi. He'll be useful to have along. Nightbenders, appreciate you, brother. I'm so Thank you for uh, updating me on everything you've been going through, man. I'm so happy for you. The Empire has abused its power for the last time. We can't allow them to get away with this. I want to go too. I think not, the young lady. <laughs> we can't have kids getting in our way. Who do you think you are trying to tell me what to do, you overfed muscle man? Kids got quite a lip. Ugh, I'm going to paint your picture. <laughs> no, Camino, stop. What? Okay, all right, already. Not like you stay at home when you're told anyway. Yay! She's so happy, look at her. <laughs> all right, let's go. What's wrong, lover boy? How old are you? Ten? Why? Weirdo, I'm going on ahead, okay? Go, go, go. They grow up faster, you think you'll break a few hearts when you're older, kid? <laughs> that, that's so much more creepy now that I'm older, man. Like, I know they were trying to be creepy, but fuck, that was creepy, guys. Oh, oh no. No, they did not. Mm. Let's get her to, um, hold on. Oh, my bad. The Imperials were heading for the sealed gate. Said they found some s statues or something. It could be. Uh-oh. Oh, those half-winded espers. To think they would open the gate for us themselves? The warring triad is waiting just beyond the door. I need only to reach out and claim it for my own, and all of my dreams will be fulfilled. Hurry it up. Huh? What's wrong, Stephanie? The island. Something's happening. The earth is crying out.
What? They have the same animation from the original game. This was on the Super Nintendo, by the way. They did this on the Super Nintendo. That, they did not have the Super Nintendo. That looks fucking cool. <laughs> so this is the power of the Warren Triad. With this and my Magisite, the world will be mine to command. The source of all magic. The Warring Triad. Those things? They're said to have turned themselves to stone facing one another. That way each one's powers would be neutralized by those of the other two. If the three were ever moved out of their perfect alignment, the resulting power and balance would destroy the world as we know it. What? Yeah, not good at all. And that, my friends, is where we're going to call it for tonight. What a turn of events. But can we be fair and just say we kind of saw it coming? We wanted to believe that the Esper's might and magic that destroyed Vector the fact that they came through and destroyed the Imperial City. That legitimately made it feel like, yeah, the Emperor would be like, holy shit, this is ridiculous, and surrendered. That It would take that type of power for us to believe, or at least kind of believe, like there was a shot. That he really was like, yo, I can't continue this. They're too powerful for us. But he continued to use Kefka. Not only to get additional magicite, but to kill his one general who he knew he would not understand. General Leo felt that his battle was for the glory of the Empire, to expand the Empire's reach. And so he felt there was honor in that. He also fought with honor. It was simply, listen, we're looking to come to take over your territory. Do you wish to fight or surrender? If you surrender, great. We'll treat you with dignity and respect. If you fight us, we will beat you, but we will do so with dignity and respect and honor. Cyan in Doma is very much like that. There's honor and respect in combat and in, in competition. The Emperor knew Leo was not long for the ultimate plan, which was simply annihilation complete control over everything just for control's sake so he was fine with faking out listen let's find out where all the shit is and then hey okay Kefka everything's good okay yeah come out now okay we're gonna use you now and Kefka's like fuck yeah let's go right now one thing that caught my attention was when Kefka was getting the magic he's like welcome come to me magicite help me build the magical empire of Kefka not the magical empire. We'll visit that in episode six. My friends, I want to shout out all the fucking awesome people in the stream tonight. We had a lot of good conversations, a lot of great people here, and it makes my, it, it just fills my heart. It, it, it was fun chatting. See all you guys, especially the beginning of the stream, we were, I, I, there's more chat going on than gameplay. There really was. And, and you know what? I, I was okay with it. I apologize. I don't know how much I can count the replay for people who are just watching. But let's thank the people who are in chat tonight because you guys just make this more fun. 
for me when I get to share with y'all. Big shout out and thank you to Elizabeth, Benders, Zero, aka Real, Pandy, Camino, Davo, Angelina Serrani, Christian, and Tyvee Ty. All of you fantastic people in the chat, thank you so much for being here. It was a pleasure seeing all of you. And if you are not in that list, if you were just lurking tonight, on whatever platform we're on, Twitch, Kick, Rumble, DLive, YouTube, whatever you're on, thank you for being here. Your watch, your view time is more of a help to us than you know. And I appreciate you. Unnamed, unknown viewer. Hopefully you'll say hi at some point and I'll be able to chat with you in chat as well. Until the next stream, two nights from now, my friends, as you know, we share the joy games every two nights. Until the next stream, stay healthy, stay safe. Go get someone a high five. We'll see you all on the next one. I appreciate you.